trust me now? You've brought me one step closer to my love. It's a good start. Who is this love you keep mentioning? The most beautiful being in existence. With a face so fair to gaze upon it is to forget all others. Perhaps you've heard of her. Aphrodite. I'm sorry. Afro who? Very funny. The last person who provoked a wrath was turned into a field pig. All right. What's next? Not here. Come find my camp in Yapetos' ruins. Before you go, Persephone has overseers and torches of Hypnos across Elysium. If we're going to weaken her influence, we must destroy them. <sighs> and we're going to need all the help we can get. Time I go meet the infamous Persephone.
I didn't get a good enough look at you back there. Now I see why my guards had trouble with you. Well, they weren't exactly easy. I'm sure they aren't what mortals like you are used to. You must be someone special. Thank you, uh, your majesty. A simple Persephone will do just fine in my realm. Formalities are for the boring. Isn't that what they say? So, Elysium belongs to you? After the rude introduction I gave you, I can't blame you for not knowing. Let me apologize. Ross can attest. Usually he's the one that does the biting. He would want you to forgive me too. Tell me your name. Let's begin again. On the right foot, this time. No hard feelings. My name's Cassandra. Then I give you my official welcome, Cassandra. Let me tell you what's customary around here. This place is mine. I know every flower, every face. I alone let them in. But there's something here I don't want. You mean me? No. There's a beast loose in Elysium and it belongs to Hades. If it gets to him that his wife stole one of his immortal mounts, it'll be a disaster. But I didn't steal it. I won't go near the things. They brought me down here in the first place. No, someone wants me to look bad, and I need that horse gone. The Hades? I'll take it you aren't a happy couple. He's tried, of course, to bond with me. But what can he expect out of a prisoner? Love? That's just stuff of legend. You think someone would do this to you? It's highly unlikely the thing got in here on its own. I have to remember Elysium is my paradise, not everyone else's. I'll see if I can find the horse for you. What does it look like? You'll know it when you see it, trust me. Not only is the beast immortal, but he is terrifying. Horses don't scare me. Has anyone seen him lately? I heard screams coming from the Asphodel Algorithm. Perhaps he's scaring civilians. Bring it to my stable boy, the jockey of Artemision. He'll know how to send it galloping back to the nightmare it came from. That looks like a good place for a horse to take shelter.
Don't come any closer. You're all scaring my horse. He is just a gentle creature. Have you seen your horse? The others ran away screaming. Leave it to a blind man to see what's right in front of him. Of course I haven't seen it. I'm sorry. These are hard times. I'm afraid I won't make them any easier. I have to take that horse from you. You can't! First Persephone takes my sight, and then you take Orphe? Our friendship was instant. I heard the neigh of a fierce horse. I approached him, unafraid. And he licked my palm. Did you say Persephone blinded you? She had one of her godly soldiers fry me with fire. It was punishment for telling others what I thought of this paradise, and somehow it got back to her. Said I didn't deserve to see the beauty she created. She's not supposed to be in Elysium. Are any of us in a realm that boasts perfection but shows only deceit? Have pity. Let him stay with me. All right, you can keep him. But it's a risk. You could be caught. A risk I'm willing to take. Oh, Orphe, when we're safe, we shall ride together in the fields. Good news, I take it. I know Hades will be missing his beast.
Everything's taken care of. Hmm. I'll have one of my generals check up with my stable boy. I hope the creature didn't scare him too much. Not at all, rest assured. Better pay that stable boy a visit to cover my tracks. You must be the jockey of Artemision. Nice horses. I keep them clean and pretty, just like Elysium. I tended horses in my old life, too. Then you're just the boy I need to talk to. I have a favor to ask. What favor? If Persephone or any of her people ask, I need you to tell them that I brought a big, scary horse to you. A scary horse? We don't have those here. Then you'll have to pretend. There is Drachmi for you if you do. You're silly. We don't need Drachmi in Elysium. You're sure you're from around here? Of course, I knew that. No matter what, you need to do what I say. Why do you want me to lie? Because if you don't, I'll make sure all of your horses get out of their pens and run away to Tartarus. Understand? Tell them I was here. Fine. Just leave my horses alone.
He stood there, soaking wet and sputtering, while his boat floated away from him down the Eridan River in pieces. I'd give my sharpest bronze dagger to see that silly human trying to leave Elysium on the Falooka. Have you visited my mother recently, and given her my love? Always. The meteor sends her love in return. Well, I'd better get back. Elysium won't rule itself. Do keep an eye out for me. I sense trouble brewing in paradise. I was starting to think you'd never get here. You can't waste time if you hope to break Persephone's control over the gate to the underworld. I... You might be playing both sides with Persephone and Adonis, but I know where your true motives lie. Is that so? Unfortunately, no one passes through the gate to the underworld without Persephone's permission, which she has never given. Ever. Luckily for you, as the goddess of crossroads and keys, locked doors happen to be my specialty. Are you saying you can get me through the gate? I'm saying I can help you bypass Persephone. From what I just saw, you're pretty close with Persephone. Why would you want to work against her? I'm not asking for your blind trust. Let me prove our goals align. This unlocks the door to Persephone's hidden sanctuary. She keeps all of her most intimate possessions there, stowed away from her husband. Among her treasures is a journal rumored to contain information you desperately need about the gate. Bring it to me as soon as you can. I'll go get the journal. The sooner you bring me it, the closer you are to leaving Elysium. Don't waste any time. Something's blocking this. Something's in the way. Hmm. Won't budge.
see if Agati's key works. Then, find that journal. Journal is missing pages. I hope Agati still wants it. Better stay hidden. Let's go. I'm not sure how stealing Persephone's journal will help me open the gate to the underworld, but here it is. Stealing Persephone's journal wouldn't help us, but stealing the journal that belonged to the gate's locksmith will. Who's the locksmith? It doesn't say. Looks like a lot of pages were torn out. Now be quiet while I read. Well, that was illuminating. So? What does it say? Oh, so eager. The location of the gate is not revealed. But so long as Persephone controls Elysium, you need her permission to pass through it. Which you will never get. But if she loses control of Elysium... She loses control of the gate. You need to undermine her influence any way you can. And how do you suggest I do that? Your alliance with Adonis is a good start. His head-on tactics are a little obvious for my taste, but in time, he will wear down Persephone's forces. What about our alliance? Where do you come in? I know all of Persephone's weaknesses, and I'll direct you to them when the time is right. Until then, you'd be wise to spend some time with Persephone's lapdog, Hermes. Learn to use that staff. You'll need a divine weapon in the land of gods. <laughs> <laughs> 